This is Wayne here, the head brewer for Cigar City Brewing. Uh, today we're brewing at uh, Great Lakes Brewing in Cleveland, Ohio. And with me is... Luke Purcell, one of the brewers here at Great Lakes, and our club brewer, Joel Warger, over here. How are you doing? <laughs> um, so we're brewing a, a big black lager today in Cleveland. And um, uh, Joel, can you tell us how um, we came up with the recipe? Uh, yeah, I think the basic idea was uh, we're known for one of our lagers that you guys are known for one of your ales, so we decided we're going to make just a black version of each one. Um, ours is going to be an Imperial Schwartz beer, so there's going to be some black malts and flaked oats, uh, some Munich, and just a hint of smoke, and I think you're going to have like a nice, smooth, dark, roasty lager to drink afterwards. Awesome, thanks. Um, so the name of the beer is going to be called uh, Wandering Pelican. And it's, like you said, a split series ale being brewed in Tampa, Florida, and a lager being brewed up here. Um, Luke, can you elaborate on the name some? Yeah, we went through a lot of ideas for the name, and uh, kind of at the last hour, one of our, one of our people, Marissa in marketing, told me about this pelican that had, had wandered up towards Cleveland from, from down south somewhere, we're assuming from Tampa, obviously now. It has to be. Um, but yeah, it kind of got lost, and it was spent a few months uh, down here on the shores of Lake Erie, so it was out of, out of its place, and uh, we thought it was a cool story. It had its own Twitter feed up here, stuff, Twitter handle, and it became like a little local uh, celebrity type story with this bird, so we thought it would be cool to name. Since he made the trip, and we're making the same trip to make some beer, we thought we would just name a beer after, after our little pelican friend. Right on. Sounds good. So, one week from now, we'll be brewing the old version in, uh, in Tampa, Florida. Uh, we'll talk to you again then. One week ago, we flew out to Cleveland and brewed uh, our half of the club um, at Great Lakes Brewing in Cleveland. And we made a, uh, a big, dark um, lager. And today we're brewing uh, an American Black Ale. Uh, the American Black Ale is a little bit different approach than usual. Um, with a lot of American black ales, uh, many that I've had in the past, a lot of the, the, the approach seems to be, well, let's just use citrusy hops and let's just basically sort of treat it like uh, a dark American um, IPA and uh, we, we're approaching it differently. So we're using hops like uh, Ella, which can give like black anise flavors. Um, and we're also using uh, Pacific Gem for Blackberry. We're using uh, ADHA 527 for Black Raspberry. Um, and we're using some Brewer's Gold for uh, Black Quran. So our approach is more dark fruit specifically versus the citrus approach and piney approach that some of uh, the other American black ales usually express.